Hey, Skull Guy, how are you doing? Just to let you know, this is a Super Bowl free, a Super Bowl spoiler free stream, so please don't tell me what's going on. I know it doesn't start for another hour or two, but. Actually, what time is it? So it's, it's 2 o'clock my time, so actually, yeah, it doesn't start for another couple hours, so we'll, we'll probably will be okay, but just, yeah. We'll see. Okay. I'm so sorry guys. I got a bunch of people killed last night when I was playing. I don't know if you guys were here, but it was bad. Uh, oh, actually, yeah, that's fine. I was just going to update the uh, the Twitch title. There we go. And for some reason, I'm going to reload my dashboard. It's not, It's doing weird things. And so is my game, apparently. Game's crashing. I was lord of this place. Before the crows and rats made it their domain. Okay. What is going on? Yeah, guys, I don't know what's going on. I don't know if you guys had trouble, but, like, I've been having all kinds of authentication problems with Twitch. Like, I'll go to log in, like, it won't work, then I click again and it works, and... Yeah, just weird stuff is going on. Sorry, that's why it's taking me a minute to get uh, situated here. Okay, um, yeah, so first we lost Nacho. Congratulations, Nacho, you are our first blood, our first casualty, as it were. Um, we also, uh, unfortunately, we also lost Gale, Platypus, Zinchenko, Dr. Thrust, and yeah, so these are the characters that I lost last night. Um, so we lost Badger, Big Blood, and Doom Cake, and Viking. This is when my, my brother called me on the phone, and so I was talking with him, and they all died. And then I had one more one where we lost Mr. Belgian, Pickled Reptar, The Hound, and Guppy. So, yeah, they're all dead. Um, so, well, the good news is, though, that means that we have some extra slots in our roster. So um, that's, that's kind of cool. But, uh, again, bad news is we have a graveyard that's rapidly filling up. <laughs> Adventurer Hellion Sl Yeah, so we, we, we died to the Wizened Hag. The problem, um, I don't know if you guys were there, but the problem was um, with the Hag, you she puts this pot in front of her, and so you, you can't hit the pot, basically, because she throws one of your guys in the pot, and then they boil in the pot, and then what happens is it, you... Um, you have to like hit the pot to get your guy back, but then the next turn she throws another person in there. And uh, yeah, so now we have a we have a bunch of we have some spots in our roster, and we have a fair number of uh, people that we need to rename. So we have a like a plague doctor, we have a new um, jester, uh, we have a let's see who else did we have? Oh, we have at least one more occultist and one more highwayman, and we lost we lost our crusader unfortunately. Uh, the other problem is that we have no money, and so basically this next mission is going to be a bunch of red shirts probably dying. And we hired everyone already, okay. Yeah, so we, we have no money for torches or anything. So yeah, this is, um... We're in a bit of a pickle, but I think this game is about perseverance through adversity. And really, I think with this game, like, it seems like they will they'll give you some easy fights. And so really, I think the key is just, you keep going forward, right? You keep, you know, trying to crush the enemy and you, even collecting a few relics and crests and things, um, that helps oh, in the long run. I can't do any of that because that costs money. We're just going to have to embark. Ugh. Let's see here. Yeah, so the wise and hag just crushed us. It was not, it was not competitive, <laughs> as we like to say. Uh, let's do a short one just to see if we can get some guys going. Um, burrito? Actually, yeah, Burrito, we're going to, uh, we're going to roll with you, I think. And then let's bring Cyphus. Yeah, so, so Cyphus would have been okay in that last one because we could throw the daggers. Oh no, Nacho, I think that's entirely incorrect. I fully expect both of us to die before we uh, complete this, before we beat this game. Toxin trickery. Oh. I 
Yeah, we, we get to name more heroes after viewers and stuff, so I'm not I'm not super concerned about it. Uh, let's see, who else should we bring? So this is level one mission, but honestly, again, we don't have we're not going to be able to buy any food. We're not going to be able to buy any torches or bandages or anything, and so I think this mission we're just not going to. We're just going to throw people in there, get a little bit of money, and then come back. I think we're going to have to do that. So I think what we're going to do is sort of develop a team of um, stressed out people. And basically their goal is to win like a battle or two, collect a little bit of loot, and then leave. Um, I don't know, though. Let's bring Jonathan, too. I know we had a Jonathan in here. And he's got, uh, he's got the Grape Shot Blast, the Duelist Advance, the Open Vein, and the Pistol Shot. So that's actually that's a pretty good combo. Yeah, I just, I, I basically, I brought the wrong combination of guys. I think Brutal Loser was doing well, too, so we'll bring you. And then, uh, do we have any, I guess he can heal, can't he? Cyphus? Let's do Cyphus, I guess. Provisions! None. Yeah, this is gonna be, I mean, really, we can only explore a couple rooms before it gets dark and my people just freak out. So... We'll see, though. Yeah, definitely. We'll be able to get... Uh, when we get some more viewers in here, we'll get some more people to join us in the graveyard. It's a sad day when you have more people in the graveyard than you have viewers, but that's okay. <laughs> By, like, four times. Oh, man. I knew all these paths once. Now they are as twisted as my own ambitions. Let's go this direction. Um, it's, we, they want us to explore 90% of rooms, but that's, I mean, again, we, just, we have no torches, we have no food, we have nothing, so that's not going to happen. Let's just, we'll just get a couple rooms and then ditch out, I think. Okay, Jonathan, you're going to take a peek. Oh, stash drive looms, that's handy. Oh, no, we stepped on a trap. Cruel machinations spring to life. With a singular purpose. <sighs> Let's see what we can get. Um, it's actually not bad. Or just chop somebody. Or just go crazy damage. Get revenge and then focus. Let's just try to chop this front guy. Shot blast. That's actually yeah, let's do that. Or not. Come on, Jonathan. Poison dart. Oh, okay. Thrown dagger. Flashing daggers. So this has half as much damage to two people though. Let's just throw a dagger at uh, the spungle snatcher. Or the artillery. Let's do the artillery. Okay, now we'll do some, um, let's do a tenebrous pull on this guy in the back, bring him closer, because that way I think that, I don't know if they'll be able to do the rend for the old gods now. Oh, he can jump back too when he does that? Oh, that's so pointless. I guess it wasted his turn. Seven. This is going to be a very quick mission, guys. Especially because I can't heal him because he's bleeding. <gasps> this is so bad. Press disadvantage. Oh, nice! Give Double no kill. Quarter. Good job, Jonathan. As the fiend falls, oh, a faint hope blossoms. Faint hope. Okay. I think now we go for the hue. Hue attack. Oh no, one life and five, okay. Let's, uh... Weird reconstruction. Let's put that on yourself. Yeah, I think, I, I really think I prefer the, uh, the Vestals for the, you know, healing. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. So, so far, Jonathan's MVP. Toxin Trickery. 
Yeah, so apparently that would be handy, I think, if you could, uh, if you could cast it on the people. That's my only issue with it, is that you can't drop the These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Berserk Charm. Two speed, 15% damage, plus you, but you take more stress damage and you're more likely to get stunned. The Sun Cloak. Ooh, that's good. It's not going to be good for us today, but uh, let's open it. It's trapped! Oh, that's okay. We got a scout off, too. That's kind of lucky. Let's go ahead and go this way. Again, I think we're only going to be able to do a few more um, missions. We got a torch. Burn it. Looks like we're gonna have another fight up here on our hands. Uh, Cypress, why don't you pick up the sack? Yeah, we got some money. Fight! Oh, not the ectoplasms. Oh, hey, we surprised them though. That's actually really good for the ectoplasms. Because that means we can do. That's pretty good. Uh, grape shot? Or just attack? Open the veins. Open veins. Oh no, that's bad. Guys, that's so bad. Oh, that's so bad. Because now they're going to multiply if we don't kill them right away. Okay, well, we killed one. Um... Please, please, please. Okay. Now, once those guys start hitting you, every this time they attack, they, they multiply. Success. And so it's it's actually pretty hard to kill them. I guess the leper is pretty good against them because you can kill multiple ones at the same turn. But they are not trivial. Okay, let's go down, I guess. Okay, Jonathan, let's see what's in this carcass. Bulimic. Oh. Nature herself, victim to the spreading corruption, malformed with misintent. Um. Let's do one more battle. Um. And if not, or if this room is empty, then we're gonna leave. Okay. Yep. Yeah, we're leaving. That was uh. That was pretty fun. But we got some loot. We got a little bit of money. We got 500 and some deeds and some charms and things. Stress of defeat. Regroup. Reassemble. Evil is timeless after all. So bad. Stomach cramp. He takes less healing. In town will never drink. Okay. Slow reflexes. Oh no. Uh. It's not good, guys. Oh, it's not good. My obsession caused this great foulness, and it is shameful that I must rely upon you to set it right. At least we got a little bit of money, though, so now maybe we can do a short mission with a good team. Uh, I don't think that we're going to be able to buy anything either. Let's just go ahead and embark on the next